Hey everyone, Mr. Hester's here again with Science, and today we're here, we're gonna be building some Rube Goldberg machines. And I've got my daughter, Jalen, here with me. And uh, I challenged her, I gave her this light switch. Uh, this turns on uh, lights in our kitchen. And I said, hey, here's a light switch that uh, you can use to build your Rube Goldberg machine. I really want you to complicate how you would turn this light on. And here's what Jalen came up with. All right, so this is Jalen's really cool uh, Rube Goldberg machine. I'm gonna get her to tell us a little bit about it. So what's going on here, kiddo? So I took the stand mixer and I made it so that there's like dominoes and when the stand mixer turns on, it's gonna knock the dominoes over and it's gonna come over and then knock the tennis ball over and it's gonna go down this ramp and hit the bucket over and then it's gonna pull the phone box off um, of the lever and then this candle is going to fall down and hit the button. It's gonna turn the lights on. And did you use any simple machines in this? So I used levers here and then I used a ramp and then I used another lever and we could have used a pulley, but we didn't. So. <laughs> All right, so Gold, uh, Rube Goldberg it. Okay, Alexa. Turn on the coolest light switch ever. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> so part of the fun of doing Rube Goldberg machines is uh, they don't always work the first time. So uh, we're on reset mode and we're going to try it again. All right, Jalen, let's try it one another time. Alexa. Turn on the coolest light switch ever. Yay! <laughs> Good job. So that's our Rube Goldberg machine. Jalen did a great job showing the one that uh, she developed. Uh, I think it had six or seven elements in there and uh, did a great job of turning on the lights here. Uh, I hope you guys have a lot of fun building your own. Thank you very much.